Hi everyone, this is Quinn from Power Admin. Today I'm going to talk about uh, inf monitoring Internet Information Services or IIS. If you go to our how-to page on our documentation you'll find some very helpful information on a few monitors that you can use to monitor this service. As you can see on this page here we have uh, the first monitor we talk about is using a service monitor and we list three services there to monitor for this. The Windows Process Activation Service also has a few events uh, that you should be monitoring for as well. Some warnings and some errors. So that's the second monitor that you can use and that would be the event log monitor. Then of course with most applications there's the performance counters that you should be monitoring. And we have a list of a few monitor, or excuse me, a few counters that you should be monitoring, uh, with some suggested defaults. Of course, with any applic, uh, with any service that you're monitoring, your your thresholds will vary depending on the usage and needs uh, that you have for that. With that said, I'm going to go ahead and go to PA Server Monitor where I've already set up a server with those three monitors as you can see here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and start with the services monitor. I've created the services monitor here with just those three services that we are monitoring and uh, I'm not monitoring anything else. I've gone ahead and set the schedule and actions already for that. And with that uh, service monitor, we also have the event log monitor. And let me scroll down here to uh, the event source that we need to monitor for those event IDs. Uh, where is it? There it is. Okay. Uh, the Microsoft Windows was event source. I've already set up the filters with those event IDs. Uh, that we're looking for and I've set them to monitor for warnings and errors. <clears throat> the, next perform, uh, the next monitor would be the performance counter monitor and as you can see I've already set this up as well and I've added uh, those, mo uh, those counters in uh, here as well and as you know there are many counters to select from uh, these are just a select few some suggested ones to be monitoring for. Um, that's the basics in setting up and monitoring for IIS. Of course each application is a little bit different. Uh, so good luck on monitoring those. Have a great day.